So boys and girls, it's Monday the 18th of March, I'm your host Thomas Adams and this is the Game Zone News Recap. Our top story of the day involves EA trying to mend that huge gaping pus filled wound known as SimCity 5. As originally promised, EA will be giving everyone who purchased and registered SimCity through Origin one free game and I must say that the list is pretty good and includes Battlefield 3, Dead Space 3, Mass Effect 3, Medal of Honor Warfighter, Need for Speed Most Wanted, now these are all standard editions, not anything you don't get any DLC or anything like that. Bejeweled 3, Plants vs Zombies and SimCity 4 Deluxe Edition. Overall the list of games is pretty good, although why add Battlefield 3 and Mass Effect 3 to the list when there is actually no DLC included, especially since these games are pretty much mandatory to have the DLC, well for Battlefield 3 it is at least. So man, it's a free game but you've still got a lot to buy if you were to go choose that free game, but meh. Also, one last thing to mention about SimCity 5 was that it still sold over 1 million copies in its first two weeks. Now, I'd go ahead and guess that that number could have been doubled or tripled if the game actually worked or played like it should in the eyes of the fans. So let us know in the comments below if you are actually going to choose a free game and which one it will be. Over in the League of Legends corner, Riot have released what their next champion, Zac, looks like and what his abilities are. Now he's got some pretty cool looking abilities that include an elastic slingshot that works kinda like Vi's Q but hopefully will have a better range. Also note that every time he hits an enemy with one of his abilities, they will leave a small part of him on the floor that he can pick up to regen his health. And lastly, his ultimate is called Let's Bounce, from which he jumps into the air, knocking everyone up with him, and then he slams down on the floor three more times dealing additional damage and slowing them. Overall this champion looks to be very strong, which is just like all new champions, and very powerful and hopefully some awesome strategies will develop and he won't just get banned straight away for being overpowered. So guys what do you think about this champion? Despite not originally releasing on PC via Steam, the very well known and sought after game Fez is finally coming to Steam this May. Now the reason Fez is very well known is because of its pretty goddamn hard puzzles and awesome platforming gameplay with its unique art style. I for one cannot wait to get my hands on this game because despite what I may say I actually don't have any consoles, I am a PC Master Race gamer, gotta throw that out there but I really cannot wait, I hate it when it's when they're like the games are exclusive to certain consoles and I can't wait to get it myself so man I'm so happy. And lastly, that ever so successful TV show and video game, The Walking Dead, is releasing its next game tomorrow, dubbed The Walking Dead Survival Instinct. Via a leaked copy, we actually get a sneak intro, which actually looks and feels just like the TV show does. Hopefully this game will be as awesome as its previous versions and the TV show, but only time will tell. Now I'd suggest waiting until our official review is up, just in case you've got any doubts in your mind. Remember that you can check out the latest news on www.gamezone.com. I have been your host. In fact, leave a comment to say who has been speaking. Hmm. And of course, this has been the News Recap.